Hey, welcome to a new episode. Uh, in this episode, I'm going to show you how I modify this uh, light switch to meet my needs and why I do this. But yeah, it's kind of interesting. And I'm not going to make uh, any videos uh, in the winter time because there's really nothing uh, interesting to post. So. I don't know, maybe one video per month or maybe more, it totally depends what I'm going to do in the winter time because I don't need, I don't see the need for posting stuff that's randomly pointless like shoveling snow and so on, but yeah, let's head off to the modifications. I want to tell you is uh, if you don't know about the electricity then please for God's sakes please don't don't do your uh, it by yourself so uh, now uh, the product by Panasonic uh, Vico series uh, is quite good uh, and I like it because it's uh, really robust. It uh, works with uh, in the, uh, with uh, UV lights, uh, so I mean uh, the sun, and it doesn't degrade over time, and it's really waterproof, and it's it's really well uh, thought out product, and yeah, that's one reason I like it. But. Uh, Electricity isn't a thing to play, uh, and I'm going to show you why. Uh, so let's take this apart first. So this will go into the trash. And why I need to modify this switch is because. Uh, uh, this switch uses one uh, voltage in and two outputs, so you have two uh, switches. How this uh, looks is like uh, this uh, electricity comes in, it splits into two, and it has two separate uh, connections. Uh, but what my need is, uh, I need two separate connections. There are products on the market that uh, will meet my requirements, but uh, I really like this product, so I'm going to modify it to meet my personal needs. <coughs> First thing to note is uh, why I didn't buy any different product is because this product is rated at uh, 16 amps. Uh, the usual light switches are 10 amps, uh, but for my need, I need one channel for 10 amps uh, and the other one for 16 amp switching. And I don't want to use uh, other products because uh, the problem is if you use a light switch and don't know what you're doing, uh, you may uh, put it between a 16 amp and over time or in the short term, this may melt down. Uh, the best is it just melts and nothing happens. But if you're using some uh, cheap products, uh, then what may happen is it uh, will start in, uh, or, uh, will uh, start a fire, and you don't want to see what happens if uh, a, a switch melts down and your wall will get, get on fire. If it goes well, uh, your fire extinction extinction extinction. Uh, fire uh, extinguishing system will start and it will just put it out but if uh, if you're not so lucky your house may burn down or even your family members or yourself so let's see if I can show you ah, more details what I'm doing uh, let's put it a little bit closer so you can see so, here you can see uh, channel 1, channel 2. Uh, this is the channel that the uh, voltage will come in and it will split into two parts. 
but for my needs I need two separate channels so what I'm going to do is take this off take this off take this part away take a second uh, switch now and take this part and put it here let me see what okay it's a little bit long so how can we modify this okay uh, where are the pliers uh, one second so okay let's cut this Bigger pliers. So let's cut this off. You're going here. And where's the second one? And you're, you're the second part. And fuck. Okay, we have a small problem. Uh, let's see how I can fix this. Yeah, this can be done this way. So, you're going here. And which way up are you going to be? You're going this way. So, and you're going this way so you can see now I have two separate channels and, uh, what? where this side maybe no all the way around uh, this way no. I would love to use this can I somehow modify this to meet my needs Maybe I can. So you're meant to be used this way. If I pend you the other way around, uh, I still can't use you. How the heck can I modify? this uh, maybe I can no I can't use you uh, can I take this off Allow to use you, but now I'm going here.
come on. I'm going here. So you're going here. Take you off. And you're going here. And you're going this way. So now you're in, you're in, and you are going here. Come on, little buddy. And you're going here. So now let's put you all back together. Now. Double check. Did I put it wrong way in? Maybe. Yeah. I put it wrong way in. <laughs> Even if I know what I'm doing, I made a mistake and think about yourself. If you don't know what you're doing, then is it a good idea? No. So if you're going this way, then you are not going to switch. Why aren't you going to switch this? What's wrong? Let's just put it a little bit more up. Maybe I put it wrong way in. So, yeah. Yeah. Maybe it goes this way. Double check. Okay, no connection. Double check the other one. Okay, second one doesn't work. I uh, still need to modify that second part. Okay. Okay, you are working nicely. So, what's your deal? Why don't you want to work? Okay, let me check. Did I? Oh, just fell. Okay, why 
why this doesn't ah, fell off from the slot. That's the problem. Quite hard to get into the right spot. Oh, this one is broken, that's why. Okay, now you're going into the right slot. Now, let's double check. Okay, works fine. Yeah. Now the modification is done. We could say easy busy. Everything's nice and tight. And this is one uh, thing I want to say is but uh, yeah. The switch is broken. It should have a spring like this, if you can see in the video. Here's the spring, but uh, this one is uh, inside, so I don't know. Ah, look, works. Yeah, it was a little bit off. Yeah. So this will go into the trash, and this one will be used. <coughs> I want to point out: don't uh, don't uh, do this at home if you don't know what how to use electricity or haven't had the proper education. Because, like I say, many of the those switches are rated for 10 amps, and if you want to use a 16 amp for this switch uh, or similar switches, then you may burn the, your house down. So please don't do anything that you aren't certain 100%. So stay safe, don't get COVID and don't electrocute yourself. Until next time, bye-bye. Uh, one more thing I wanted to show you. Uh, even those cables that I use are different diameter because uh, not only it's important to have the right kind of thing, uh, let me check if you can see. I don't know if the camera can pick it up. Okay. Quite hard. So, can you focus? Focus. Can you focus this? Uh, let me switch on the lights. Maybe this will help. So, I hope you can tell, but those wires are, are different dimensions, so yeah, it's not only the switching, but also the wires need to be correct. So that's why I don't do electricity stuff if you don't know what they're doing. So, see ya!